Right now, a horrific attack has led to the death of a family's beloved dog. Surveillance video catching the terrifying moments in Hollywood, and we're learning the owner of the aggressive dog could possibly face charges. Local 10's Terrell Fournay is live with it all. Terrell. Nicole, Hollywood police tell us that they are still looking into the circumstances of this wild attack that played out here on this block. This attack left that small dog dead and its owner slightly injured. <laughs> Seemingly out of nowhere, a pit bull pounces on a much smaller dog being walked by its owner. Jessica Reeder falls to the ground, unable to separate the animals. I was on the ground too because the dog is so big. He had to weigh at least 80 pounds. He pulled me down too. I scraped up my knees, scraped up my hands. The attack happened last week on Taft Street and North 52nd Avenue, a walk that Jessica says she makes with her dog multiple times a day. But this time was different. The attack lasts roughly 30 seconds until a man believed to be the pit bull's owner shows up and scares away his aggressive dog and stops the mauling. He just attacked my dog brutally. He picked him up in his mouth and he never let him down. Piper, the seven-year-old Shih Tzu that Jessica had since a puppy, died at an emergency veterinarian hospital after the incident. I am hurt. My heart is broken in a hundred pieces. That dog was my life. So investigators tell us that animal control has been notified over this incident and that aggressive dog owner was cited for not having the proper vaccination records. But at this point, all indications are is that uh, that aggressive dog has not been confiscated and is still with its family tonight. And that is something that is certainly upsetting to the woman who lost her small dog. We are live in Hollywood tonight. I'm Terrell Fournay, Local 10 News.